I think the development of the global value chains uh, can be looked at from multiple perspectives. The first perspective is the geography. The geography would be like it starts with mostly manufacturing uh, in America, for America, manufacturing in Europe, for Western Europe mostly, uh, and eventually that uh, global value chain is expanded to include emerging economies like China, like Mexico, like Eastern Europe, etc. Um, and now, of course, expanding into Bangladesh, Ethiopia, and some of the uh, developing economies as well. So that's the geographic perspective. But I think the other very major, major development in the value chain is the ability to modularize production and products. So by that, what I meant is that um, products can be segregated into components so that uh, you don't have to build a whole product in its entirety in one single location. So you can build some components, you can build uh, assemblies, some assemblies in different parts of the world, which means that you can leverage uh, the power and the um, the strengths of different locations to build different parts and then you put them together.